San Francisco is taking drastic steps to clear homeless encampments. Penalties will be enforced following a U.S. Supreme Court decision, igniting a wave of intense reactions. Mayor London Breed's administration plans to use progressive penalties to address the encampments, starting with warnings, escalating to citations, and potentially leading to arrests. Governor Gavin Newsom has ordered state officials to dismantle encampments on state property. This directive comes as California faces the nation's largest homeless population. The Supreme Court ruled in favor of an Oregon City's homeless policy, allowing tickets for sleeping outside. This ruling has influenced California's new enforcement measures. Newsom emphasized the urgency, directing state agencies to adopt humane policies and address dangerous encampments while supporting the individuals living in them. Homeless advocates argue that without adequate shelter and services, the crackdown will merely displace people. They criticize the approach as criminalizing poverty. The San Francisco mayor's office states that they will continue to offer shelter and services to those on the street, aiming to prevent re-encampments. With over 180,000 homeless people in California, concerns grow about the lack of shelter space and resources. Critics say this policy fails to address the root issues. Mayor Breed, seeking re-election, faces pressure as homelessness remains a key issue. A recent count showed 4,354 unsheltered people in San Francisco alone. Advocates argue that data on service refusals is misleading. They say many refuse services because there aren't enough shelter beds available. Before we continue, help us grow by subscribing or following us wherever you see this video. Researchers warn that punitive policing strategies like encampment removals do not reduce homelessness. They can worsen the situation by creating additional barriers. Property confiscation during clearances can deprive people of essential documents, hindering their ability to access housing and services. The cycle of homelessness continues. 